Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. So today's video is another reaction video about um, Malu Travaggio. So you guys already know before, like back back then, <clears throat> like a couple months ago, not like last year or anything. But yeah, I made a video reacting to her issue that was going on with the Cash Me Outside girl. But right now, the um, What's the Tea on YouTube dropped a video that says Manu Travaggio gets dragged by the internet for lying to everyone. Y'all already know between her story um, with Daniel Bergoli and her, people were accusing Daniel Bergoli more. But I feel like now everybody's attacking her and finding out that she's having so much drama with, with other like younger influencers, I would say. So let's get right into the video. But before we start, guys, we finally reached 2,000 subscribers. Yay! Thank you guys so, so much. I really appreciate it. Like, you guys are the best. Like, it means so much to me. Like, so much. But, um, yeah, and if you're not subscribed, what are you waiting for? Come on, we have a goal to reach by the end of the year. Like I said, 10,000 subscribers by the end of the year or more. Um, is the goal for this year. Um, let's make that happen. We can definitely make that happen. It's not, you know, that hard because you guys are the best squad, you know, here on YouTube. You guys are the best. You guys are just awesome, okay? But, um, if you're not subscribed, like I said, hit the subscribe button down below and give this video a thumbs up and comment what other type of video you would like to see next and I will surely react to it because you guys sent me this one and told me to react to this. So, I'll make sure, you know, I will give you guys what you guys are asking for. Are you guys ready? All right, let me put my volume up. And let's start. Hopefully, I won't say much because you guys can already see everything, see everything going on on the screen. Come on, call in the background. You heard it, Malu? What's wrong with these like Instagram famous kids? Come my way. 
like her. You show your ass. You show your ass for followers. Like, most of your followers are grown men, okay? What, yo? Like, what, yo? What, yo? You stole from your supporters. You lie all the time. You cry. You cry 24 7. Like, do you run out of tears, dog? Do you run out of tears, like? okay let me i have to like fold my you know shirt a little bit but um first i feel like sometimes she does have something to do with the beginning of the drama she puts herself in like she doesn't always start drama but i feel like she does um start certain dramas with certain people because y'all not gonna tell me all these instagram famous kids are all you know going on life and you know talking to her that way just for no reason you know just because they, they like met up and say let's bully Malu like no I feel like she also has a share she has something to do with this whole situation you know and what I always say is that if you want to be an influencer like public figure you just have to like you know watch what you do watch what you say especially how young they are like she's so young and she has like a big audience to herself she should stop it's not my body but I'm talking about what I think she should stop doing showing it's okay to take like pictures in bathing suit once in a while like it's cool like okay it's fine but always like posting picture of your body showing your butt doing all the stuff it's really attracting all the men that's how people get raped that's how people get assaulted like so many things happen to younger girls because of what they post on the internet not only for young famous girls but like younger girls in general like you guys already know my major is social work and my minor is sociology and I study psychology in school as well so I really work with the brain and like I feel like whatever you do has like a how am I gonna put it whatever you do like you get something for whatever you do like if you show yourself as like that person that always shows cleavage and all that you, the, what you'll be getting back would be like older men hitting on you or trying to get at you or actually trying to harm you because they want to like have you sexually you know like doing something to you in general and if like you are that type of for instance let me give you guys a great example for youtuber i really admire 
um, Shalom Black. She's a Nigerian YouTuber. I admire her because the way she presents herself, like she's never in drama. Like you never heard anything about her going on on the internet. Another YouTuber that's really known is Diera from DK4L. You never hear her on, in any type of drama. Even when you do, you will see her like post some tweet, then take herself out because she remember, oh snap, I have an image. And they do post nice pictures, but they're not always showing the body, you know. Malu is so young to be showing all those parts of her body. Like, what about like later on when she get want to get in a serious relationship with a man and let's say get married eventually. Like her man is, if it's like a man that's not out there in the, you know, uh, social media life, he's not gonna want to be with somebody like that. Okay, we understand she was young, she made those mistakes, but then again, like showing her body like that is not actually what she should be doing. On my, in my opinion, all the time, at least she shouldn't be doing that all the time. Once in a while, like I said earlier, it's okay, it's fine, like that's fine. But all the time, no. Also, what I wanted to touch base on is that I feel like. Before the Daniel Bergoli, no one really know like knew about her like that. I feel like she should just trying to like you know keep focus on her career and leave the drama behind because I feel like she can do really good in the future. And the last thing I want to touch base on for all of you guys watching me right now, it can be kids, grown ups, those people that are involved in this you know video I just reacted to. I hope when you guys are having boyfriends, I don't care if it's your husband or fiance boyfriend, husband, fiance, like a guy in your life or a soulmate or a significant other or someone you're just talking to, do not send nudes because I'm actually scared of this young influencer that when, for instance, when she was with the NBA boy, I'm scared that he probably got some nudes, some pictures of her that he could expose her with to mess up her career eventually in the future, you know? I hope none of y'all that are watching this I sending news out there like let that person see that in real life okay and that's about it we're not going to you know send pictures and videos and you know we don't need all that I don't care if you put your face on it or not because I know some people will be like oh I didn't put my face on that picture it was just my boobs and my butt I don't care okay I just feel like I need to put some type of sense in so many people's head especially these younger influencer like they don't see the future they're only living life day by day they're not seeing what you know they can get what negative stuff they can be getting from what they're doing now so guys that's it for today's video i'm done rambling i hope you know this reaction really helped you guys since you guys really wanted me to react to this and also hit the subscribe button down below once again if you're not subscribed like what are you waiting for we already passed 2,000 subscribers next go 3,000 and up let's get let's go you're the best squad like just squad we out here like we're making it big but yes, guys, um, like this video and comment down below any type of video you would like to see next. And I'll make sure I do those videos for you guys. I'll catch you guys on my next video. Bye, guys.